So I'm just kind of worried here. I think I drank so much anxiety. I've got neurosis of the liver. And well, I suffer from anxiety and like, well, you know, neurosis. It's not neurotic, is it? I mean, to be uh, anxiety ridden, is that is that neurotic? No, right? It's not. I shouldn't worry about that, right? Because, you know, I don't want to appear neurotic or full of neurosis. God, no. So just checking, right? Okay. I don't want to worry about that too much. I don't want to dwell on it, you know. If I dwell on it too much, then it could be like, uh, I could be neurotic. And uh, that's not good to be well full of neurosis and be neurotic about having neurosis and be neurotic about it because it's just not healthy. Right? Okay, good, good. Well, I'm glad you agree because... Uh, Having neurosis is not a healthy thing. It's it's neurotic, typically speaking. And people who have neurosis are typically neurotic, and they go on and on about that, um, and they have anxiety about that. So uh, just don't dwell on it. That's my point. Uh, if you worry too much about it and dwell on it, then you could be, in fact, uh, well, neurotically neurotic. Now, if you're neurotically neurotic, and then you're wow. That means you got double neurosis. That's uh, that's a double neurotic. So, uh, what if you're a highly sexually charged person? Then you probably would be well, erotically neurotic. And if you're worried about that, and you're worried about performance and workplace and in the bedroom, then you're probably erotically neurotic about well, sex and work, and just well, neurotic about that. So don't think about that. And uh, it's not its not very erotic to think about neuros neurosis and being neurotic, is it? No, it's not. It's not romantic. And it's not erotic. So, uh, I guess I just won't worry about that too much or think about it too much. Because you could be, like, obsessive-compulsive about that. And if you're obsessing about that and compulsive about that particular disorder about being neurotic, then you're probably full of neurosis, and that means you're probably, well, compulsive about your obsessiveness about your disorder of neurosis and, and being neurotic about that. So my point is that you don't want to be OCD about that. Um, you know, uh, it's not a healthy thing. So you kind of want to just uh, not focus on that is my point. So uh, that's not neurotic, is it? To to like focus on something like that, or to unfocus. Oh, okay. So if I were to unfocus about that, then I, I probably would be done with being neurotic, correct? Okay, good. So I just won't focus or unfocus about it. Maybe I'll defocus. There you go. I'll decompress and I'll I'll defocus about being obsessive compulsive about being neurotic and having neurosis. And then, uh, well. <laughs> If I defocus about that, that means I'm probably unfocused. And if I'm unfocused about being me too focused, oh, I'm really unfocused about that. So if I'm not focusing on something, I'm unfocused, that means I probably am obsessive and compulsive about being unfocused, about having neurosis and being neurotic. Um, wow. Okay. So uh, let's not focus on that anymore, shall we?